With an extensive background in sports medicine, Dr. Michel Leglise is well suited for his various roles in gymnastics. He's the president of the International Gymnastics Federation Medical and Anti-Doping Commissions and a member of the FIG Scientific Commission. He is also first vice president of the FIG and a member of its executive committee. Born July 23, 1942 in France, Dr. Leglise is an avid sportsman. He was successful in team sports as well as athletics as a runner and a triple jumper. He began his professional career as a 24-year-old pediatric orthopedic surgeon. At the age of 26, he was nominated to become the chief medical officer of the French Olympic Training Centers, which encompassed all sports. Because of his specialty in orthopedics for children, Dr. Leglise was more concerned with ice skating and gymnastics. He was fascinated by gymnastics in particular, and he was requested by the French Gymnastics Federation to become its chief medical officer. Ten years later, in 1982, Dr. Leglise joined the FIG, for which he still serves today. With degrees in biology, sports medicine, occupational medicine, and ergonomics, Dr. Leglise continues to teach university courses as a member of the Faculty of Medicine in Tours, France, and he maintains a private orthopedic practice. Dr. Leglise's expertise has expanded beyond the FIG. For the International Olympic Committee, he is coordinator for the Medical Commission's Sport, Child, and Adolescent Working Group, and he's on the Cultural Commission for the Youth Olympic Games. He also holds positions in the International World Games Association, the Association of Summer Olympic International Federations, the International Federation of Sports Medicine, the World Underwater Federation, and the Mediterranean Gymnastics Confederation. Even though he volunteers an enormous amount of time to gymnastics, he still manages to develop one of his other passions, art. Dr. Leglise, who has written numerous articles on growth biology and the athlete's spine, volunteers his time and talents for nothing more than the satisfaction of helping to improve the world of sport. And the international gymnastics community may be the biggest benefactor of his unselfish gift.